Hi, my name is Jesse Jones-Smith, and in the next couple minutes, I'm going to give you a brief overview of my current research portfolio. One of the primary goals of my research is to investigate the role of social, economic, and community resources as drivers of nutrition-related health disparities. So along these lines, the first of my current projects is a natural experiment to examine whether increased economic resources are causal factors in weight-related health. So in this natural experiment, I model Native American-owned casinos, which were legalized with the expressed purpose of promoting economic development and tribal self-sufficiency as a positive shock to the economic resources of Native American communities. Then in turn, I'm investigating how this positive increase in economic resources might impact the risk for overweight and obesity among Native American women and children. This study includes data from roughly 100 tribes in the state of California, approximately 60% of which own a casino. As an additional part of this study, I'm interviewing tribal leaders and community members to gain a better understanding of the pathways through which economic resources stemming from these casinos might impact health. In a second natural experiment, I'm examining whether the introduction of a large supermarket in a lower income neighborhood can result in improved dietary intake for neighborhood residents. In order to do this, I'm collecting dietary intake from residents in the neighborhood that will get the supermarket, as well as residents in a demographically similar neighborhood that will not get a supermarket and instead will serve as a comparison group. I'm going to survey residents in both neighborhoods before and after the supermarket opens in order to determine whether dietary intake changes as a result of the supermarket. Finally, I have a few ongoing secondary data analysis projects that document socioeconomic disparities in the risk for obesity in various populations. One of my interests is in how the relationship between socioeconomic status and overweight or obesity might be changing in low and middle income countries as these countries experience the nutrition transition. In this realm, I've used data from the China Health and Nutrition Survey to document the emergence of a disparity in overweight prevalence among women in China, whereby women with the lowest education level, shown here with, in the line with the square markers, now have a higher average BMI and higher risk for overweight compared to women with the highest education levels shown here in the solid line. And in the US, I'm using data from a nationally representative survey called the Early Childhood Longitudinal Study in order to examine how early in life these socioeconomic disparities in overweight risk begin to emerge. I find so far that for whites, Asians, and Latino children, by age three to four years, those with lower socioeconomic status begin to experience a higher risk of overweight. So that is a brief summary of my current research portfolio. Please visit the Department of International Health Center for Human Nutrition website and or my faculty website for more information. Thank you.